Hello YouTube and welcome to Crusader Kings 2 A Game of Thrones. Yes, I've never done this on my channel. So I thought it was about time. There's your complimentary phone going off as always. Ooh, this looks so fun. We are going to be doing the Clash of Kings starting era. I am a big Game of Thrones fan and uh, read books and things. And I loved a little story by uh, Telltale Games where they told the story of the family of the Foresters in Ironrath whose motto is Iron for Mice and they uh, they have a huge rivalry with the people in High Point but I thought what if I took over? What if I started playing as said Foresters and I went and tried to change the future of Westeros using the Forester family. And it's going to be hard. They start off with a really, really crap kingdom. Right. Whoa, there we are. Lots of pop-ups. See, House Forester and the White Hill have been locked in a bitter feud, always competing over the precious ironwood. This feud has continued throughout the years, aided by House White Hill's change to the set faith of the Seven. Those White Hills shall never have our Ironwood. There we are. See, I could be in Game of Thrones completely. Um, right, Northman culture effects cannot take others as concubines. Is traditionally anti-slavery anti culture. Can hold castles and forts without penalties. Can build cit castle cities, temples, and fort holdings. Kingsguard government vassals are not included in the vassal limit calculation. Interesting. Priests can inherit titles. Uh, there is and can exist no religious head. There is traditional anti-slavery. So slavery is a part of this. Nice. Right. Lord Gregor and I declare that my brother Robert left no true born uh, issue of his body. The boy Joffrey, the the boy Tommen and the girl oh, Mycella. I can't, can't say Mycella in a northern accent. Marcella being abominations of incest between Cersei Lannister and Sir Jaime, the Kingslayer. <laughs> I do uh, uh, apologize to any Northerners uh, here. Uh, uh, by birth, by right of birth and, and blood, I do lay claim to the Iron Throne. Let all, me let all true men declare their loyalty. Sign Stannis of the House Baratheon, the first of his name, King of the Andals, the Royan Na and the first, and the first men, and the Lord of the Seven Kingdoms. Mm, okay, uh, I am gonna side with the Baratheons because that's what Rob Stark, my king, would have done. I'm actually ruled though by a duchy over here. So to make proper gains, we're gonna have to make gains in this duchy first. Um, also, as the uh, as starting as uh, blah, 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 our starting character is Lord Gregor the Good of Ironrath. I'm a Northman with nine diplo, twenty martial, which is very good. Uh, eight stewardship, zero intrigue, which is a bit annoying, and seven learning. I'm also a battlefield terrain master and a direct leader. Nice. I'm just, diligent, kind, honourable, brave, skilled fighter, and skilled commander. Nice. So, uh, what do we want to do over here? I think we probably want to go war focused. Uh, just get that little bit of extra martial skill. Um, adopt a lifestyle. Fall in love. Become a paragon of virtue. Gain an honorary title. That'd be nice. Gain an honorary, rare title. Uh, our son is unmarried. Let's see what we can do. Uh, I'm going to go ahistorical. Not ahistorical for the um, uh, marriage of my first son. Uh, actually, I'm going to Elena Glenmore and my son. Yep, that's something that happens. Um, sorry if there's any uh, Telltale Games spoilers in this. Uh, but that's how it's going to work. Now, I've got Ethan. I need to set all the educations of Ryan. Uh, so Ryan is quick. Will for... Chattable, slothful, gluttonous, that's a bad one. Willful, brave, ambitious, dumb. So, okay. 
Ryan's looking to become Intrigue, so maybe give him, like, Etiquette. Uh, Talia, what's Talia doing? Um, and give her... Oh no, she just needs a focus. Uh, family person. Let's give her stewardship then. Girl with stewardship. Ethan, my eldest. I want him to be martially trained. So this is weird. Education goes on throughout little bits of older life, which is strange. We do have Asher as well, who is currently exiled and disinherited, but we can bring him back if, if all things start to go to shite. Uh, I have an unlanded son, but I can't do anything about that because I only have one province to give away, uh, which I don't want to do. Special minor titles. Designated regents and things. I... Um, if I remember correctly, there is... Duncan will do all our uh, minor titles for us, uh, because there's a lot of them. So, we have a lot more council positions, as you can see, which is part of this mod, um, if you've never seen the mod before. So we have our Castilian, uh, who... is it Cast... Castellan? Castellan? It's the person who runs the castle. Um, he can oversee the province, improve defense, pacify province, improve the holding. Uh, I'm going to have him... Do, 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 do. Let's go for tax, really. I need money at the moment. She, uh, Lady Alicia, Lady Alyssa will be um, trying to fabricate claims on Kingsgrove. We want to try and get this duchy as ours. Then we can get some real Game of Thrones-y action going on. Um, Roderick's being married off already. Da -da 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 -da. We're 49, so we're relatively old. Master of Arms, so Royland. Uh, yeah, you can train troops. Although, train children might be a good idea. Hold on. Oh, damn. Okay, let's give it to Roderick. You can train the children. And you will build a spine network. Uh, okay, no, you will scheme there. Uh, Maester, they just exist. You can't do anything with them, but events happen from maesters. Proselytize? No. Perform charity then. Okay, we've got an unland the sun. I know. Oh, it's not going to happen with the title, so I'm just going to... Oh, I need to show commanders. That's what I need to sort out. Uh, Royland. Master of the Hunt. Uh, bodyguards. Uh, my sentinel will be dunk. No, I'll give Roderick my sentinel ship. I, your lordship. Garrett Tuttle can be a bodyguard as well. There you are. Okay, so I'm going to unpause for the first time. Uh, beyond the wall. Oh. The north. The north is one. So created the title Lordship of the Trident. Iron King Balan, the second of the Iron Isles. Declared the Iron Islander invasion on the, of the North on King Robert the Young Wolf. So we're currently fighting the War of the Northern Independence. So, um, so we're fighting the Lannisters, which isn't fun, and we're fighting the Iron Islanders, which is something that happens in the series and in the comics. The comics, uh, in the books. Sorry, got Walking Dead in this confused for a very minute moment of time. Uh, let's boost the speed up. Uh, to the uh, the Honorable Noble Gregor, peace be with you. I accept your suggestion that Sentinel Roderick and Elena get married. Lovely. Uh, what is this? Uh, support me in the can Uh, okay. 
Uh, I will take the prestige. That was me a favor. Right. We... Where's the wedding? I swear there's a thing here for... So I can also look up all the interesting things in um, the world right now. Which is in uh, a nice little... These decision tool tips are really nice. There should be one for the marriage, but... Doesn't seem to be. Uh, all hail his grace, Rob of the House Stark, King in the North, King of Winter, and the First Men, Lord of Winterfell, and Protector of the Realm, King in the North. Okay, so we want to be defeating that guy, L.A. and Glenmore. Uh, I want to try and get an alliance with these guys now. Yeah, there we go. Nice one. Although they're not in charge of their own province, which is a little bit annoying. Right, who can we marry Mira off to? Hmm... Put the Boltons. Could be interesting. It's a Roos Bolton. Ugh. I don't think my character, though, would marry someone off to um, his daughter off to Roos Bolton. Loras, Lord of the Reach. My sexual one. Well, the reach is a cripple. How can we get matrilineally? And by age. So, o Oliver, Oliver, Oliver Frey. Reachman, Riverman, Reachman. Uh, Northman. Mm. Malcolm in Ironrath. My brother-in-law. Huh? No. You know what? That, that, that fray there, I think. I think that works. Recently wed. Lovely. And now go to show my commanders. Garrett Tuttle will get replaced with Sir Oliver Frey. Oliver Frey. Oliver Frey. As that just sounded like. Uh, there's a Ironlander army up there. Can we go fight that? Get some combat in. So Royland. Free folk invasion of the wall. Mance Raider is currently attacking the Night's Watch. Uh, Commander Jewel the Bear. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, I just got old man faced.
Come on, get to these guys. Disband our troops before any of them Grey Joys realize. A little raid on the Grey Joys never hurt anybody. Uh, student strategy. Yes, let's do that. Uh, I have decided to give you the honorary title of Master of the Hunt. Thank you. Hey, I gained my ambition. That's good for me. Fall in love, become a friend to your liege. Adopt a lifestyle. Yeah, let's do that. So as you'll notice with this, there is skilled fighter as well as skilled commander on my character uh, because there is combat in battles so when in battle my character will have combat roles and things and I'll find enemies and it's a lot harder to survive <laughs> uh, this will be fun let the best warlord win and frontal assault towards your center flank uh, slowly withdraw the forces in the center uh, use our troops as reserves for our now pressured side flank, prefer a large push on the left flank with support from the center. Ah, oh, damn it, we lost. I hereby invite you, I will travel Grand Feast in Winterfell. Sure. Rob is both stressed and ill. Oh dear. So we're currently winning against the Iron Islander invasion. It worries me just because I can't see Rob's army. And I'd quite like to be able to. Oh, Joffrey is 15 now. Selfish, wrathful, proud, craven, cruel, impaler, attractive. Cersei is married to another Lannister. Hmm. Jamie is in prison. Oh yeah, we've we've got him captive, haven't we? Right, what can we do about our province? Fort level, tax income and light infantry. Could be a nice one, but light infantry are absolute garbage, so um... Oh shit, Rob Stark died. Uh, king in, king in the north. So how did Rob die? Was slain by Gregor Fang Tao in personal combat. Oh. Right, okay, fair enough. It's a grim day for the north. Let's get... Heaven, infantry, and pikemen. I like that. My throwing arm will amaze everybody. Damn it. My son beat me. My grandson. Yeah, that's a cool name. Oh, he had twins. Hmm. 
So we got an iron forest, which is cool. And it gives us more income. However, like... Oh, Mira's had a daughter. Sure. It would be nice if I just had, like... I mean, White Hills have got loads of um, troops, and don't understand how. Oh, they've got a town as well. Uh, I will pay the most money for that. Uh, da 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 da. So why do they have the more men? Small northern castle. Ah, oh, I've got a large northern keep. Okay, fair enough. Faith of the Seven Revolt against King Brandon of the North. Ugh. Seven Bana. Nope. That was instantly one. So, it's not looking good for the North right now, but we will find out more next time. Hope you've all enjoyed this episode. Uh, not much has been done, but it had to be done as a little bit of setting up. So, uh, oh, Ethan can be married. We'll start that off with next episode. Bye-bye, guys.